What's up there everybody and welcome to another one of my videos. Another day, another moth. So what we're currently looking at is a very common species found in many parts of Africa. It's called by the scientific name Nudaurelia dione. And this Nudaurelia dione can be very seasonal and extremely common when uh, they hatch. Uh, they have about, I think, two to four generations per year in Africa and um, they usually pop up during the rainy season and during that time you can find them everywhere in big numbers and the caterpillars are very polyphagous they will eat many things uh, in Europe they have been raised on things like privet, ligustrum, uh, cherry aka prunus ah, some nice winter sunlight here um, among other things, uh, they also really like sweet gum, aka liquid amber, uh, willow, aka salix. So, in Africa, they're probably just as polyphagous, and uh, as I understand it, they will also eat many kind of plants there, including acacia, fabaceae trees, etc. So. It's been suggested that Nudarelia dione is not just one species, but multiple species in one. Um, but it hasn't been very thoroughly researched. Because I've read, uh, read in one reliable source that throughout all of Africa, these Nudarelia dione have different colors, different wing shapes, slightly different markings. So it, that means they has been suggested that it has been it's about one dozen species in one so that's that's an, a crazy suggestion but maybe it's even true more than a dozen species under the same name and maybe breeding them will help with that because we get to see images of the larva and compare their similarities now in captivity it's said to be a very easy species spawning um, synchronized generations something that's hard to do in captivity if we're talking about African species because they tend to be out of sync and hatch very late and apart from each other but um, at least only in captivity in the wild that never happens it's because they are confused uh, but it seems that Nudarelia does, Dione does not have that problem it's a really beautiful insect. Look at this, these beautiful shades of pink and purple and yellow. And this is a male. The female is a little bit bigger even. So I'm hoping I can find the female soon. That's a really beautiful creature, isn't it? Thanks for watching. Oh, and here's a bonus. In this sleeve are overwintering caterpillars on, uh, on Hawthorn. Here you see the Hawthorn. And they're Eproctus chrysorea. Uh, I don't know, I think the English name for that one is uh, the brown tail moth. So, huh. if you're familiar with that species, you're probably wondering why the heck I'm breeding it. But, uh, anyways, thanks for watching. And this was, this was Bart Coppens with beautiful Nudarelia Dione.